And we are back live here in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Uh-oh. Here comes John Moxley. Lee down the following contest. This is a hardcore match scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Cincinnati, Ohio. Weighing in at 224 pounds. John Moxley. Well, John Moxley has already been on a path of destruction, disrespecting not only the fans personally, but also everyone in the back. Tell me about it. He's desperate. He'll do whatever it takes to face the ACW champion any way that he can. No doubt about it. But for John Moxley, this is his own type of brutality. This is his type of match. Right down his memory lane. No doubt about it. John Moxley's been through a lot of hardcore matches throughout his career. But this man is going to refuse to back down at the hands of his own best friend, Seth Rollins. And uh-oh. Speaking of Seth Rollins. And Seth freaking Rollins shall appear because here he comes. And uh-oh. This is his type of match as well in his own type of backyard. Don't have at it. And, oh, my. This man is already becoming a legend in his own right. Already got a child already, but his wife, Becky Lynch, is already here with him on ACW. No doubt about it. They had a few words backstage, I'll tell you. My goodness. And his opponent from Davenport, Iowa, weighing in at 217 pounds, Seth Rollins. 12 for, the, 12 for Seth Rollins. You can call him whatever he wants to be called. This man is also known as Seth Frickin' Rollins. He's been through a lot in his career. And he's been through a lot over the years with John Moxley during their time together back in the WWE. No doubt about it, two former Shield brothers have been through a lot. Something tells me, for the architect, this is an all out war that we're gonna see here tonight. No doubt about it. Hardcore rule. Hardcore rules. Anything goes. No countouts. No qualifications. And pinfalls count anywhere in this unique type of a matchup. But Moxley staring down at Rollins. These two have faced off on numerous occasions. And something tells me though, if I were Seth Rollins, I would not want to get in the ring with his longtime friend. No doubt about it. Moxley is beating the superstars back and forth in this type of a match. He's even lost to the Mysterios the last time he was in the ring. No doubt about it. Here we go. Moxley and Rollins going at it. And a T-bone-like suplex. And Moxley thrown Rollins like a piece of meat. Goes for an early cover. Rollins kicked out. These two know the angle. These two know what it's been like being up and down the road together for over the years. No doubt about it. And Moxley has Rollins up into a high-end vertical suplex coming. Look at the power of Moxley. These two have faced off before. And a high-end drop suplex by Moxley with that vertical suplex. And Rollins is in trouble. Rollins right now already going at it with John Moxley and a lift up one handed spine buster just oh my god Moxley decimating Rollins in this fight and an Enziguri popping him in the jaw spinning hill kick nobody home but Moxley caught him into a urinagi Moxley on the cover no kick out A big right hand by Moxley, continuing to decimate Rollins here. But Rollins hasn't been given the opportunity to fight back here in this match. And there's a bear hug, fully applied to Mox, fully applied to Rollins by Moxley. And Rollins escaping that one. And a one-legged drop kick by Rollins. Down goes Moxley. And now Rollins looking for the weapon. It's legal. No disqualifications. And there's a kendo stick. The Singapore cane. And now Moxie's got the Singapore cane. Rollins rolling, rolling out of the way of that one. A big right hand. And Rollins in trouble. And Moxley just 
and oh my god, the spinning spine buster, spine first on the kendo stick, and here's the cover, is this in here, no, kick out at one. Oh my god there, Moxie thought he had Rollins beat after that spine buster on the kendo stick. And Moxie with the big roundhouses, right in the face of Rollins, now going for a backbreaker. I think Moxley landed knee first off that kendo stick. Tell me about it though, for John Moxley, he's feeling right at home in this environment over the years, and oh my god, and now slams Spike first off the kendo stick. He's trying to aim right for that spine of, of his longtime best friend to beat the heck out of him and win this matchup here. And now he's got the kendo stick, the Singapore cane. He hit Rollins right in the back of his head. These two really decimating each other any way they can to win here and try to send a message. Don't have at it. Oh, Rollins, right hand of the gut. As Moxley staggers, Rollins fighting back now. Aim right up that leg of Moxley. And Moxley in trouble. Rollins off the ropes. Running hip attack. Rollins is just stunned, realizing what I had to do to put this man away. Rollins with a knee lift right now, catching him in the face. And Moxley has Rollins in the corner. And Rollins stopping a mud hole. And Moxley walking it dry. And now Seth Rollins has got the kendo stick. The Singapore Kane coming into play. And now Rollins is just decimating Moxley with that kendo stick. Wait a minute, what's Rollins thinking? Moxley pushing Rollins back. Oh, Moxley! Going for his patent submission hold. It's a play to Rollins, is this it here? Referee asking him, do you want to quit? From a far distance, Rollins is screaming out, no, no, I don't want to quit. And Rollins escaped it. Must have been doing his homework before coming out here. Rollins going for a snap, man, Moxley countered it. Right hand, and Wolf saw the paradigm shift coming. Rollins with the right hand of his own. Rollins off the ropes. Curb stomp, oh my God. Moxley landed face first off the kendo stick. Cover here, two, no. I don't understand it. That cold son of a gun is still standing. I don't get why Moxie would survive a curve stop after being stopped face first off that kendo stick. I don't know, but Moxley is just doing whatever it takes to survive this matchup here. Moxley right now in trouble as Rollins goes for the schoolboy super kick. Lights out for Moxley. That one's got to be it. One, two. Rollins picks up the win. Moxley losing to his longtime best friend. Oh my God, look at this. That spinning spine buster, my God, let his spine first off the kendo stick. Then that submission hold where Rollins escaped it. Like I pointed out earlier, he must have did his homework before facing Moxley tonight. As you can tell, countering Moxley's patented finishing maneuver, the paradigm shift. He saw it coming, but then the curb stop was all it took. Even to the final nail on the coffin, the schoolboy super kick to the face, and it was lights out for Moxley. Here is your winner, Seth Rollins. Seth Rollins defeating John Moxley in his own type of a match here in the ACW Divide and Conquer from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Well, what a win for Rollins and surviving Moxley. Not that bad, but we're not even through here yet, folks, because stick around. Coming up next, Elias versus John Cena. 
The match that was made by our general manager, Noah Anderson. It's huge, and it's next.